Welcome to Lombard Street, San Francisco, California. Yes, narito tayo guys sa Lombard Street. Tinatawag nila itong Crooked Death Street. In fact, hindi nga raw. Nakakalito naman. Pero syempre, alamin natin kung ano ang history behind it. On the other hand, we will be showing you the scenic views of the top of the hills bago tayo bumaba sa dulo nito. Yung bandang dulo naman yun ang Marina Bay. Kitang kita rin natin ang Alcatraz Island. Also, nasa top tayo ngayon dahil sumakay kami sa bus number 19 kung saan sa top ng hill ang daam. Pero maraming options pwede rin mismo rito sa tapat ng Lombard Street by cable car. Yun. When we get out from the Pop Street and Lombard Street, we notice the bicyclists going up to the hill. Ang akala namin ay nagbibisikleta lang, then bababa uli siya kasi nga hirap siyang umakyat pero mayroon siyang technique. Kung gaya na nakikita ninyo, pasigsag-sigsag siya. Diba nakakatuwa? Hindi nga namin napansin na nasa itaas na siya. Napansin na lang namin nung pababa na rin siya sa Crooked Street. Good job, Manong! <laughs> Talking about zigzag, ang Lombard Street ay talagang zigzag. Ganito ang makikita natin pag top shot or aerial view. So guys, bababa na tayo. Pero tatalakayin natin kung bakit may ibang tao nagsasabi. Hindi nga ito Crooked Street in San Francisco. Sabi kasi nila, meron pang isang Crooked Street in San Francisco. Una, build as the most crooked street in the world because of its famous for its single block featuring eight hairpin turns yun nga naman pala eh. since it was determined na merong 27% grade of the hill was so steep for most vehicles and even for pedestrians plus uh, the cobblestone switch box were designed to increase the ability to travel safely here it's a one-way paved malamang dahil kung hindi magkakabulbul ang mga traffic or sasakyan <laughs> joke isipin na lang ninyo very steep tapos zigzag pa ano kaya magiging scenario nito di ba hmm? okay tapos ang street ay with red bricks in it and now become a famous crooked fashion wow street lang naging fashion pa at kailangan sumunod din sa speed limit of 5 mph Gaya ng sinabi, hindi ito ang crooked street in the world kahit sa San Francisco dahil may street dito sa San Francisco na mas higit pang crooked ang Vermont Street in the Potrero Hill. Kaso lang mas maayos ang pagmamanage ng city to remain a much more popular attraction ang Lombard Street. Ang nakakaalyo lang sa famous attraction na ito kahit maliit na block ito, you will enjoy and encounter so many gorgeous photo ops. Gaya nito! The Magnificent Martians Pag ikot mo Magsasawa ka sa beautifully Landscaped gardens At saka para Magkaroon pa ng dagdag na attractions Nagtanim pa sila Ng iba't ibang kulay na mga bulaklak That frame Lombard on both sides Tingnan ninyo ang ganda ba? Diba? Ngayon kapag nasa itaas naman tayo, you would enjoy looking out over the sweeping view of the city including the Bay Bridge, tingnan niyo, and the Coit Tower. Yan, uh, marami ding pumupunta diyan for Instagram kasi masyadong Instagramable. At saka pag nandito ka, makikita mo ang ganda ng city skyline. Kung nasa kaligitnaan ka, ito ang makikita mo tayo. May ka mga nakatira rito, kaya pakiusap ng association nila respect them. Ang steps ay 250 and some of them are made of bricks too. To wrap up, Lombard Street's 8 word famous hairpin turns have earned it the nickname the crooked street in the world. 
plus famous cobblestone sweets box boarded by hydrangeas and victorian houses as well it was designed in 1992 and 250 steps after taking gorgeous photo ops for this one of the most famous tourist attractions in san francisco there is plenty to do within walking distance like you can visit the place such as real world house haunted mountain don scott's apartment from vertigo the fisherman's wharf the north beach and the chinatown ito nga lang on the way to the bus stop we saw this small park they call this fay park it's a public park that you can relax as well just a few seconds walk from lombard street Guys, don't forget to like and subscribe pag baguhan pa kayo sa aming channel para updated kayo every week. Salamat, mabuhay tayong lahat.